sardine fever has once again hit KwaZulu Natal. Now, scores of fishermen have been flocking to the south coast for the annual extravaganza. A shoal of sardines arrived on KZN shores the day after World Oceans Day. Ocean conservationist Andy Kutsia was at the Scottburg beach yesterday and in among the netting action. He joins us now virtually. Um, I mean, there's much excitement on the KZN South Coast with the arrival of the sardine run. Uh, please could you just tell us a bit about this new uh, natural phenomenon uh, that attracts worldwide attention? Hello, I don't know if you can hear me out here, but this phenomenon of uh, the sardines is an annual event it's pretty much like the marine equivalent of the wildebeest migration in the Maasai Mara. It's probably the largest marine biomass migration in the entire planet. And we're blessed here on the south coast of uh, KZN to have this phenomenon. All kinds of uh, marine mammals, whales, uh, brutus whales, dolphins, bottlenose dolphins, common dolphins, gannets, predatory fish, sharks, all kinds of things um, attack all these fish or eat these fish. It is it's just a huge protein source moving from the south of our country all the way up to north towards Durban, and then veers off into their Gullis current and then migrates down south again. So it is one of those things that we are blessed with in our country. Um, south Coast tourism all the way down from Durban down to Port Edward and Dumbwana River has the opportunity to showcase this mass migration of fish. And it is an unbelievable phenomenon. Just shortly, um, I just saw some uh, gannets diving and some common dolphins working a bait ball. But yesterday, it was absolutely may it was absolute mayhem. Fishermen are netting fish. There are fishermen catching fish, say netters catching. People are eating fresh sardines. They are eating frozen sardines. They are eating tin sardines. We're all familiar with Lucky Strike and Glenrick. These are all the sardines that we have eaten over our lifetimes. And this mass migration of fish continues every single year, sometimes a little bit further out, sometimes closer to shore. Depending what happens with the currents and the predators, sometimes the sardines will get chased right onto the shore dump, and then it is absolute chaos. For everyone grabbing sardines with their skirts, with baskets, it is just a phenomenon that we in South Africa, and especially south coast um we are blessed with this we don't have to travel overseas it's right on our doorstep and this is what makes the south coast of kzn such a wonderful opportunity to see this marine environment and this phenomenon that happens every single year now andy you are the envy of anyone who's not at the south coast at the moment obviously initial reports indicating that this year's sardine run is said to be a great spectacle as it has been for the past two years. And as you were hearing Andy saying, and the visuals that we are showing on your screen right now, it is something of a, spectac a spectacle that you'd need to be there to see it, to really uh, experience it. And also just fresh sardines um, right now would absolutely do the trick. Andy, thank you so much for your time this morning.